What's up? How are you guys today? I'm going to show you guys the healthiest breakfast, or at least as close to the healthiest breakfast that I know of. And uh, I do not appreciate the smack talk about my oatmeal last week. You know, with my nutritional expertise, my prowess, you know, hey, maybe you guys should, uh, you know, zip it up a little bit. So, you know, for probably like the past 10 years, I've never really eaten breakfast, but uh, I really need to start doing it because what happens is I don't eat in the morning, I don't eat lunch, and then by three or four o'clock, I'm still at work, I'm exhausted, I'm hungry, I'm tired, and all I'm thinking about is going home to eat something. But when I do have breakfast, when I do have food in my stomach, I have a lot more physical energy, I feel better, I can go to the gym before I get home. Overall, my day ends up being a lot more enjoyable, my brain works better. So I'm gonna show you guys what I've been trying to do lately, uh, mainly just substituting some hash browns and more whole foods. It's pretty basic, guys. We got the pork breakfast sausages from Frankie's Free Range Meat. When we run out of this, which is very close, I'm probably just gonna have like the spiced beef sausage. I just feel like for protein in the morning, I need to have something that has a lot of flavor that's really enjoyable, whereas the rest of the day, I'm okay with more plain stuff. Uh, we gotta peel and dice up these uh, potatoes to saute them in the pan. And then I have some whole apples I'm going to peel. And then there's a few other things here and there, supplements and uh, masticum that we will have with the breakfast. But I'm gonna get everything ready, guys, and then we'll sit down to eat to talk about everything else. So the only thing I don't like about this meal is how long it takes to prep the potatoes, maybe like five minutes. So you could do this at night, peel them, chop them up, put them in a bowl of water, and then in the morning, just strain them and put them in the pan because as you can see, the sausage is already finished cooking and potatoes are still raw. So we're gonna put about a tablespoon of oil in the potatoes. A sprinkle of the salt from Frankie's Free Range Meat. And then what makes potatoes really good for me, I love our steak seasoning on them, which is just onion, garlic, and mushroom. Really makes the potatoes really palatable and delicious. All right, so we got this on a high heat. They're probably gonna take about 10 minutes. All right, guys, I actually got a plumber here fixing the heat. So I'm just gonna talk about the meal real quick and I gotta go, and then I gotta go to work. So. We have the animal protein, the pork sausage, going leaner so the meal doesn't have as much fat because if we use too much oil on the potatoes, if there's too much fat in the meat, it's gonna lower the gut motility a lot, the liver's gonna release more bile, overall not gonna feel that great because you know my overall goal in this diet for the past few years has been to detox my liver. Little more potatoes, hash browns uh, than I'm actually going to eat, so I overdid it a little bit. I would say between one potato and one and a half potatoes worth of hash browns is plenty. This is two potatoes, so as I said, a little more than I normally have. In the potatoes, we have those plant-based minerals. There's fiber, starch, excellent overall, really like the healthiest carbohydrate you could have. Granted, it's like a white peeled potato that you cook long enough to you know, reduce those anti-nutrients, make the starch digestible. And then on the side, we have, as always, our apple, which is another kind of high water, high volume that's good for just gut motility, keeping things moving, a little more sugar to kind of diversify the carbohydrate profile and utilize the digestive capabilities of our liver, gut bacteria, and enzymes. But overall, this is really as healthy as you can get because whether it's pork or beef, it's minimally inflammatory, it's animal protein. And when you get into the dairy, when you get into the eggs, it kind of throws some things up in the air. The potatoes are just like a whole starch food source with an excellent balanced mineral profile. It's not gonna deplete any vitamins, which is what we worry sometimes about with the grains, the oatmeal, the rice, whatever it may be. So potatoes are definitely by far the best starch source and hash browns are very suitable for breakfast. And then we have an apple, as opposed to someone having like orange juice or a juice that's gonna be really like liquid high sugar that's gonna kind of bomb the gut bacteria and it's just feeding, overfeeding it too much, which is not great for candida, not great for overall gut health. So it's a really nice balanced breakfast where you're getting all your vitamins, all your minerals. It's minimally inflammatory. It's delicious. It's approachable. It fills you up. So as we said with the running out of the pork sausage, I'll probably switch over to beef sausage sometimes in the future. And maybe I will have grains on occasion, but this is definitely like a healthier, better starch option. Of course, we have the uh, masticum, we're gonna have maybe a teaspoon with the meal, hydrating with the bottle mineral water. And uh, I would give you guys a sneak preview, but we don't really have them 
pictures on the website yet. I should probably just put them up without the pictures and let you guys buy them. Uh, we're taking magnesium, vitamin C, vitamin B1, and vitamin B9 with breakfast because I did have a lot of grains yesterday. Uh, I can tell I definitely need some vitamin C. Always take magnesium and B1 and B9 I take depending on how I feel. So hopefully uh, this gives you guys some inspiration ideas for breakfast. Try this out, see how you feel eating it as opposed to the typical bacon, eggs, and toast. But as always, if you guys could please drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week, and be sure to check that notification bell so they don't notify you of my videos. Therefore, you guys can go to frank stefanocom to see all of my businesses. We have awesome high-quality meat products on Frankie's Free Range Meat, a variety of other products on Frankie's Free Range Foods, non-perishable stuff. Uh, we got to get the water kefir back in here. I definitely enjoy the grains for breakfast. And then you can get the Masticum on organsupplements.com. Always wearing my Wi-Fi shielding clothing, guys, underneath. Thanks again for joining, and we'll see you guys soon.